Hello guys, gals, and unspecified pals. Welcome to a new episode. I'm here with my niece. Yeah. And we're going to play Craig. Or at least I think that's how you pronounce the name. I have no idea. Now let's... Let's start this game. I have never, literally never seen this game before. Neither have I. Another beautiful day, Craig the Fisherman turns, ready to face it head on from the comfort of his person shop. He looks like a Grim Reaper stick. Like, I mean, scythe? Uh, yeah, I don't know. It's called it. a scythe. Scythe. Like, staff is the thing you must burn. He looks but like he has a crow head. Maybe he's a crow in disguise. Oh. Jesus Christ! Okay, that's enough. You have to save the ellipses. Dot 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 dot. Question mark. <laughs> the, the door, door won't, won't open. open. Whoops. <gasps> Sorry, I barricaded you in. Motion. I want to hug him. There's a door on matches. There appears to be something barricading it from the other side. I thought you said you didn't play this game before. I didn't. <laughs> I just. I don't know. You have a really good guess. No, 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 no. Just look inside my cup and make it blue. No. If you look at it in the light. All right, let's get back to our game, Missy. Yeah, forgot. There's a game. This is terrible. What is Craig to do? It? We can't get out of this house. Why, why is he report? Why is why, he? Why is he talking in third person? I was about to ask that. <laughs> you rotate a different way, so. Why was he referring to himself in the third person? Pardon my grammar. <laughs> you are Craig. Okay. Really, I thought I was Bob. Let's see. He has a weird way of walking. <laughs> Look, greet, pull, take. Take. Craig doesn't need any need another cloak from inside the closet. I don't care. What? It'd be use it'd be useful, but then he'd have to ru ruin a perfectly good cloak. Craig values his possessions too much. Stop talking about Let's look at this. Craig's closet. It's too big. Speak up. Craig's closet. It is too big. It can practically be considered a walk-in closet. Let me in. Jealous. Craig considers it. But what would he do if something actually answered back? Hello, cabinet. <laughs> Meanwhile, the cabinet's like, oh, hey, bro, thought you'd never say hi. And Craig's just standing there like, oh, shit. <laughs> this is my first video with my Jennifer. Pull. Pull. Craig pulls open the closet inside with dozens of cloaks. And then identical. Identical to the one he's wearing now. You have way too many cloaks. You can never have too many cloaks. Craig is... Very fashion forward. Yeah, huh. Let's look at this. Oh, it's going to be cake. Craig's desk. Craig's There's a note on potion making, clearly organized on it, and a drawing below. And a draw and a drawer below. Take it. Take it. Take it. Let's greet it. Uh -huh. Well, well, it's true that Greg greets his work every day with a smile that doesn't seem so appropriate right now. Uh-huh. You're right. Craig gives the drawer a pull, but it seems to be stuck. Take. Take it. Craig decides to snatch it. Snatch up the potion recipe. Okay, potion recipe. Potion recipe he was working on for his next potion. 
Craig got the recipe to top half. Top half of what? Uh, top half? Craig must have gotten frustrated with the recipe and torn it up. If only he'd know how essential it would essential. Essential it would be to ultimately ultimately become. Hello, bed. It's too early in the morning to get to reach sleep. Let's get the bed then. Craig's bed. It's much larger larger than he is. Well you've gotta have a bed that's bigger than you. How else are you gonna flop all around the place? I will sleep. So do I. Why can't it be weekends every day? Because we got shit to do during the weekdays. Those are weekdays that exist. Then I wouldn't be able to do my stuff! We could do it on weekends. But then we'd be like, why don't weekdays don't ex Why can't week weekends die? And then, because and then there'd be no days and we'd all be living in the void. Every day would be a weekend. Hey, can I carry you a pencil? Let's use the bed. While sleeping away, it's problems. It'd be nice. Craig has a shop to run that he needs to get to. Nobody cares. No shop for you. You pick which one we're going to do this time. Push. Craig gives a little push, but the action doesn't say that's good. Like, pushing the table does have much purpose. <laughs> Stupid game. You're just dumb. Let's look at the table. Craig's dinner table. There's a place mat and some fake flowers on it. Really? I never knew. Those are flowers? Yeah. Okay. If only Greg had a host guest to greet. Maybe you should get a wife. Oh! Ray snatches up the place back from the table. Incredibly, there was another one right underneath. Dump <laughs> papers! Dump papers! My life is a lie. Great. That's great. Craig converses with the plant. He seems happy. You better be happy, plant! No, wait. No. What? If the toilet, if we can talk to the toilet, I feel like we should do great. Great. What? The toilet, if we can listen to it. Okay. Maybe let's, let's... Maybe let's... Maybe let's... Craig's favorite plant. He isn't sure what kind of plant it is, but he thinks it's very pretty. I ship it! Oh! Great! Uh, no, I'm not right. Yeah? Uh, Alright. Craig converses with the plant. Seems very happy. Oh, yeah, I already did that. Let's push the plant. Craig doesn't want to knock over his favorite plant. What if the vase breaks? Broke. Who cares? Excuse me! That plant is love. That plant is life. He gives better vase. What? He gives better vase. And he could make the pieces out of that and something new. Craig took a small clump of the plant's root. Even though he doesn't know the plant's identi identity, identity, he hopes it will be useful. Let's go say hello to the toilet. Great. It doesn't need to, to blow to the porcelain gods. <laughs> Bow to the porcelain gods. <laughs> the toilet. Greg's toilet. The plumbing is kind of old. Who cares? The toilet. Clay brushes the toilet. It makes an unpleasant noise and fills back up with strange liquid. What is this? Cold water. Craig, Craig obtained oil virtual. What? What did this get in there? It's supposed to be water. Perhaps later. After finding the oil of virtual in there, Craig is terrified of ever using this to his toilet.
for anything ever again. It's a toilet. Craig's bathtub. The sides are so high that Craig needs a step ladder to get in. Sure. Truth bomb. There's a bar of soap on the edge. It's good. It's greeted. It. <laughs> Craig's voice echoes off the side of the tub. He is entertained. I don't know, we'll go check that out. That's the tub. Well, he has arms, you just don't see him. I'm thinking of many things. Crates of potion making supplies that wouldn't fit in the shop's storage. Craig doesn't remember what's in them. So. Where is that? Isn't that a bunch? This? No. Where is that? No. Crates of po potion supplies. What's what? Is that Right there? At the edge? Right there, where I right can't there. go? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I can't really- I can't interact with it. A trash can. Okay. Thanks is hello to the trash can. There are one- There are- There are one and the same. He is trash. Thanks oh. shows the trash can really the frustration. He sort of regrets hitting his feet, hurting its feelings now. I don't know. Magic. Make sure she's trash can for anything useful. And useful things. As if on cue, he pulls out a piece of something he was working on earlier. We got the recipe bottom half. Bottom half the recipe. It's trash can. Now what do I do? What? No, they're not. Well, they're not yellow, yellow. They're just stained. Let's see items. Uh, you can't use the mouse on this. Options. Nope. I'm gonna use the mouse. Alright. I'll see. can help you with me. Alright. Fred's sink. It's kind of clean. Water is off. Just tell me when I get back, okay? Alright. Fred comes to the room for the sink. It echoes silent. Slightly. I pull the faucet. The water is now on. Will that really help? Really help? We'll probably mask it down the drain. Might make him feel better. Craig thinks it might come in handy and would rather hang on to it for now. Placemats are already clean. Not. Craig is strong enough to move it by himself. Craig snatched up the soap from the edge of the tub. Faucet is on. Welcome back. Hi. Hey. Well, I found some soap. 
I got some soap, and um, now we're going to use it on the water. Frank decides to wash his hands, though he is no closer to accomplishing his goal. His hands are much cleaner. Frank will falls it again. The water is now off. So what, what are we doing? Let's look at the stove. This being his home though, it sees more use cook and whatever. Maybe you should save eating your jelly beans till after the video. Because some people don't like the sound of people eating. Well, what's the point of making a video with you when you're not going to be here for most of it? Well, some people whisper words, kind words to their cooking to help it taste better. Craig is not one of those people. Whoops, hit the wrong button. <laughs> Let's pull the stove. Craig pulls the oven fire box. Finding it isn't lit, he decides to resolve this. Let's use. Let's cook the oil? Craig is, isn't ready to die. <laughs> of course, Craig isn't ready to die. Nobody is. Let's use the root. Maybe not. The refrigerator? Um, Placement. Place, placemat? Yeah. Well, that would certainly get rid of them all. It doesn't seem quite productive. When did you, when did we even get the placemat? Let's take something from the fridge. Try to pick the lime that was inside the cabinet. Ugh. The lime? It's, no, where is the lime? Here it is. Well, it is true that lime needs to burn in hell. <laughs> Limes need to burn in hell. Craig has more important things to take care of first. Uh-huh. Right. Alright, let's, um... Soap? Maybe not. Maybe not why. Alright, let's try the recipe. Craig needs that recipe. He can't burn it. Alright, well, let's try the recipe. Craig, why don't you have to do something? Like, at least take. Alright, uh. Question mark. I want to do question mark! Question marks over the world! Craig places the lime to be used for a potion. It doesn't need to be used for a potion. Yes, it does. Yeah. Ooh, soap. Plant root. Craig threw the plant root in for a potion. Uh, the soap. Alright. Craig drops the soup into the potion. Did you just say soup? So <laughs> the desk takes top is a workshop and use It's lost to him. Mm -hmm. idea. Craig found his host key. Hey, we'll see if that will get us out of here. Locked and then unlock the door. Nothing was accomplished. Why did you lock the door first? Wasn't uh -huh. it already locked? Now what can we use the key on? I don't know, but I think you should put the other thing that we have. There's something else that we have that we can put in the question.
It isn't the kind of window that opens. Why don't you just break the window? I don't know. Oh, go to the potion thing. Alright. How can you just walk through a chair? Magic. Okay. Uh. Take? Uh. Bring your tape off. Okay. Uh. Then you could put stuff in the potion. Use. The art fixture is stuck. Craig can't get it off the wall with his bare hands. His hands? Yeah. Oh yeah, he does. So, he just shows it. Harvey, I can see it. Harvey, you're cute. Hmm, maybe we should take a break and figure out what we need to do, and we'll come back to this game another time. Okay. Let's save. And there we go. Okay. See you guys next time.